Her buddy, Still Not Sky here. Hope you're having an awesome day so far. In today's episode, well, we're doing much of the same because, you know, vault hunters, you hunt vaults. It's what you do. Um, however, following a couple of tips from you guys, which I actually kind of realized myself when we were talking about those, but I didn't actually factor into this thing here as well is obviously we want to make sure that this crystal has all six sides exposed all six faces so that we can uh let's actually do this in case they're like i'm gonna fall off at some point <laughs> um yeah so we can uh we can now get yeah nice we can get uh six six sides of that full now instead of just four uh, also <laughs> Uh, I've been told these are, yeah, these do look more gray, and I kind of was wondering that. So apparently, um, the, yeah, the, these crystals that generate are not as good as ones that you create with an altar. So yes, even though we get these for three, we're still going to want an altar, and we're still going to want to do normal crystals as well. Some nuts guy. Grab gaming by the nuts. Now, I do have a skill point. And I'm tempted to potentially, because I accidentally got Vein, Fortune Vein Miner, which I would like to have at some point, but... Uh, I didn't necessarily need it right away. I'm kind of tempted to get one extra point in the Vein Miner, uh, just to increase that back up to four. Or save the point and put it into either haste or speed. And I think this is what I'm leaning towards. I think we're... I want to be able to break spawners. So we're going to save for the haste. All right. And with that decision made, without further ado, let's just defo, mother trucker. Let's go. All right. Here we go. 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 Let's remember to mark our path. There's a sneaky little nook over here. Oh, wow. Well, this is a cool little room. Well, this is satisfying. They're in a nice little spot so I can't get knocked out very far either. Well, that was a lot of kills in a short space of time. Good for experience. Noise, noise. I see you. I see you. Where the hell did you come from? Where did you come from? Where did you go? We're not going to get any tree saplings on this one. Oh, there's a little secret spot here as well. Oh, and it's got gilded chests. Oh, shit. We got a Lytra? What the heck? Okay. We have some Elytra. Ooh, an Omega gilded chest. Doesn't have much exciting stuff in it, but okay. Am I collecting books? I do have a book on this one, so I guess... Might as well get a stack of books, so that inventory slot is used fully and completely. Uh, lots of things just spawned. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, hey, guy. Hi, guy. <laughs> Poor Skellington. See, having haste would be great for this as well. Like, mining these are good, you get the coins, you get experience from mining them. But, being able to do this faster would be fantastic. I can't wait to learn all the secrets as well, man. Because Vault Hunters, the, the last couple of seasons of Vault Hunters, there was always secrets. There's always some kind of secret stuff where if you could learn about it, you could gain loads of value. <laughs> the one, there was one season where I had a specific room where most of the time that room would spawn with a weird section behind a wall that was just all purple wool. But then there was the occasional time where the, all of the purple wool, instead of being purple wool, was chests. Like, a hundred of them. And in each chest, in each chest was a single inscription. Uh, it was a single... Oh, what were they? Uh, there's something useful. I can't remember what it was now. But in each chest was a single of these useful things. And there was shitloads of them. Way more than you'd usually get. These are quite a... It's quite a, quite a funny little secret to know. Amethyst Shard. Is that actually got any value to it? I mean, I do have the Amethyst thing back at base now, which generates... I mean, it spawns inside 
these chests. That's what she said. <laughs> so it's got to be useful, right? Hmm. Oh, wait. Our one andesite. Throw away five dirt for the gold and eight diorite for the emerald. Okay, fine. Now, these health potions are a bit easy. Dealt with. Alright, let's get the guy out of there. Moving swiftly on. Now, this isn't one of the special spawners that runs out, is it? This one will keep going. Where did all you guys come from? What the hell? Like a whole crowd walking through over there. And this is why we want to be able to break spawners fastly. Okay. Okay. You get me? Might be able to stand on a candle. Not anymore, haha. -ha. Vault meat for the soul value of seven. I don't have any idea what that means. Probably worth more than six string, though, maybe? Yeah, it's taking way too long to clear this. Let's get the heck out of here. Let's get the heck out of here. Oh, of course, that was a spawning chest. Oh, hey, buddy. What are you going up there for? Ah. Oh. Okay. And archers. Oh, okay. Okay. Don't like this. I'm not like this. Hmm. Archer makes everything a little bit more sketchy. Where's the path that I marked? I swear I marked it when I came in here. Yeah, it's there. Okay. Let's move on to the next room. I don't think there's anything going to be particularly valuable in this room that we can't get in the next room. Apart from death. Which was in the last room. Wait. My mana is low. Need to be careful for a minute here. Oh, hey, guy. Where's the archer? Huh? There he is. Okay. Arrows don't work so good in Zivata. Hey, another right chest. Oh, I already have one. Okay, what can we throw? Paper? I think I have an okay amount of paper. A lot of enemies here. Hmm. Kind of stupid at this point. Just Because they're not grouped up, I can't kill them fast enough either. And... Haha, ha, screw you, spawner! Get the heck out of here! I guess three copper ingots? Oh, there's a diamond in so I'll probably order those. Yo, where the heck did Tiny come from? Oh. Netherite scrap as well. For 38 hours, I guess? Bruh. Oh my... Mm. Fuck off, Archer bitch! <laughs> Fuck you. Why do you so much fucking damage? Oh, sh Let's not have this happen again. Let's kill the chests up here, I would really like, but I'm not fucking sacrificing myself for them. 1 minute 59. Yeah, let's get the heck out of here. No! Fuck you! Ugh, okay. Please tell me I marked my path. I did not. Okay. Shit. I really thought I had marked my path. That's not it. Let me just... That's open. That's not open. I don't know what that means for me, to be honest. I think that means I might need to go left here. That's a lot of guys. Ay ay ay. 40 seconds, dude. I'm so dead. There's a skeleton here. That might be a good sign. Yes! 28 seconds. Holy shit. Got pearls. Woo wee!
Oh my god, that was just sketchy as F, bro. Someone left me a tip in my comments. On my first episode, they said, because he walked into a room and all the end, all the other passageways were closed, you could have ascertained where you were from there. Now, on the basis of the situation in that situation, all I went into a room and everything else was closed. So that's like the tip of the pyramid, straight shot back to the exit portal. Now, that time, because of that tip and because I was thinking about that, that time I saw that we had two closed exits and one was open, which to me led that would, that was probably the corner near the tip, right? So the tip's over here and the corner. So I was at the corner. So I knew that I had to turn left to get back to that main strip from the, you know, from the, the, the portal that's a straight shot up to the tip. So it was that tip, even though it was something I kind of already knew and had thought about, but because you put it in the comments, and I read it today, actually. I was thinking about that, and that saved my ass with eight seconds to spare. So thank you for that. Much appreciated. Oh, this does produce vault crystals. Huh. Crazy. Now, I think these ones just basically run out of, of real value quite quickly. I wonder what the point of being able to get so many of these is. Obsidian, stone bricks, diamond, and chromatic iron. How much chromatic iron do I have? I know I got some. We have three ingots there. Okay, so we have enough to make an altar. We can we can make an altar. Good to know. And then I think we can start doing proper vaults, which have more value to them. In what way? I don't necessarily know. I've got spare diamond axes, which is good, because this one's running out. All right, I think we're uh, good to jump back in. Should uh, should be able to get our next skill point after this one as well, so we can then get our haste, and hopefully, uh, hopefully that's the right choice for us to do. All right, well we start off with a mine room, so I guess we should do a mining mining session for this one. Anything more secret up here? Any any nifty stuffs? No. Uh, any, any hidden secrets? No? Okay. Yeah, guys, in the comments, if you are aware of any secrets, I always love Vault Hunter secrets. Especially because they usually give you quite a bit of value in some way, shape, or form. Let me know all of the secrets. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Oh! Oh! Oh my god, what are the odds, dude? What the hell? Not what I meant to do at all. Jesus. Ooh, an ancient debris. Hmm. All right. Cleared out the mine room. Took us what six minutes? Isn't too bad. Throw some of that junk away. Not a not a bad little mine room hall, I guess. Man, mine rooms used to be very exciting. The old the old mine rooms in old season two. Oh gosh. A CRP mine room. Oh my god. Yay! Stonefall. Definitely is a good idea to pick that up. <laughs> what? He just jump shot me. What do you mean, dude? They're getting smarter, I swear to god. It's like the new 1.18 AI that I don't know about or something. Damn it! I forgot again! Ah! One of these days, I'm gonna get in the habit. Is it this way? I don't think it was this way. Ah, and I'm still trying to press the button for Optifine Zoom. Oh, good. This is not the way. Wasting time. I'm a big bad time waster. <laughs> Not me to take that much damage. Mm. Nice safe room here. And in, in addition to that, it's also a room where we can go mining. And we already have some mining stuff, so that's nice. It is nice. 
nice. More gold, more iron. I don't know. Should I be getting all this vault rock cobblestone? Or more crystal shards, I guess? It seems, it seems it's very common in these, these vaults. So I don't think it's too much of a worry. So I've also been told in comments to break all the grass for seeds. I don't know why I need to. I mean... I don't know why it's that important, but we'll grab some seeds. Screw it. <laughs> I keep expecting Spriggans to spawn. That's the wrong mod pack. <laughs> Alright, that's enough seeds for us. I think we also got some beets over here. Beets. And surely, surely beets wouldn't be included in one of these rooms if it weren't something that we might need, right? I feel like these rooms are designed specifically to for the sky block to be able to give you things that you wouldn't necessarily otherwise be able to get, but that you do need. So I'm just hoping that they're not going to include pointless crap in these rooms, basically. <laughs> and I forgot to mark my path, so we got to double back and see where we are. Oh, well, I guess we don't have to double back to see where we are, because wait a minute. What the hell was the noise of that mob? Bruh. Oh my god, dude. I was not expecting that. Okay. Oh, they can climb the chains, dude. <laughs> I did not know that that was a thing. Okay. So, next change is not safe. Cool. Good to know. Good to know. Where are you going, dude? I think if I go this way and then left, I should be at the tippy top of the pyramid. So I'm going to guess that this is right. So I'm just going to put a block there for now. <laughs> like there's a lot of spawners going on right here. There's a permanent spawner right there as well. Six minutes. Okay. So what we're going to do here. So I should just going to come out here. And mine up all of these little blocks first. Let all the minions amass themselves. And then we'll just leave them all with our sweeping strikes. Here's me, a standing with all that I would like to mine. Oh, what the fudge, dude? How? What? How? We're just. What? I don't. I don't understand what's happened. Did the zombie spawn on my little platform? If so, that is bullshit. The actual F dude. Okay, this is not going to be what I wanted to do. So, we've got four minutes left. I gotta be quick here. And then we're gonna go like that. Do not want to get out with eight seconds on the clock left again. That was squeaky button time. Okay, okay. I don't even have space for these. Go to the books. He keeps blocking the spawner break, but it got broken. But I don't mind the minions get massive like this, as long as I can clear them out effectively. It doesn't end up wasting too much of my time. This is really good for experience. Okay, I dropped something. Look at that. Yeah. All these. Those. Uh, and then I want to get this one silver coin as well. All right, let's get the hell out of here, man. Let's get the fork out of here, dude. Wait, is it even possible to get villagers in the Skyblock version? Now, funnily enough, I think I am where I thought I would be, but not coming from the direction I thought I'd be coming from. This is the right way, though. I am terribly confused, not going to lie. Minute 50, you know what? Let's not mess around. Let's just get that guy out of here. Hooray! We didn't die today. Huzzah! We only got 1,693 XP, though. Yeah, that was not the best of runs, but we did manage to gain our level. Hooray! All right, so we got our... We got our left skill point. I'm really tempted on this haste, man. Really tempted on this haste. Speed, I know, would also be very good, though. Mm hmm. I think 
we'll take the haste. Boom. All right. Cool, man. Exciting. Uh, excuse me. Now, because these crystals are the level that you mine are when you mine them, uh, actually, I got a level five one here, so we'll do that. And what we'll do is we all we will let these build up so that we can mine them out at the higher levels possible. Sag, but we can get rid of our netherite axe. Goodbye, my friend. You are about to break. We fixed it. <laughs> Too late now. <laughs> All right, well, we're just going to throw our junk away, and that pretty much is that for the day, guys. I'm probably going to have to start doing some expansion of my base. I mean, a lot of you guys in the comments of the first video were talking about, like, expanding with dirt and building a farming area and stuff. I've just been vaulting, so I should probably maybe do some of that stuff. Anyway, we'll do that soon. Hope you guys have an awesome rest of your day. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more, consider subscribing and get your booty in the comments. It's always great to see you there. <laughs> Hope you have an awesome day. Take care, guys. Bye.